Welcome back fellow coders, Jared O'Leary here with Boot Up. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add color effects when you click or tap on a sprite. So first thing, uh, I want to just point out that I'm on the letter J. You can tell because this is highlighted. So over here, we have our space where we can put all of our code. And over on the left, we have the code blocks that we can use. Now in Scratch, whenever we want to do something, we always want to start with an event. So you can click here or you can scroll up and down. And there are a bunch of different events here. The one that I want to do is I want to use the one that says when this sprite is clicked. Let me zoom in using this button right here so you can see the code a little bit better. So when we click on the letter J, we want it to do something. In this case, we want to change the way it looks. So we can go up to the Looks tab, and there's a bunch of different options here. The thing that I want to do is I want to change its appearance. So I'm going to say Change the Color. So I drag this and connect this just like puzzle pieces. So now whenever this sprite is clicked, the letter J is going to change the color effect by 25. So let's check this out. So over here I click, and it just change it. Click again, and again, and again, and again, and again, and again. And you can actually go in here and you can change this number. So you can make it so that it changes it a small amount. So it's changing it just a little bit and I keep clicking and clicking and clicking. Or you can even make it a larger number like 100 and then it'll change it to different colors. You can also actually click on this triangle right here and it gives you some more options. So let's say you wanted to try out fisheye. So now when you click on it, Whoa. makes it look pretty um, different than it originally started as. Now, you might look at this and go, okay, I don't actually like that effect. I want to fix it. So one of the blocks that we can use to fix it, to reset the appearance, is a clear graphic effects. So what we can actually do is we can simply just click on this, and then bloop, it fixes that sprite. Or we can actually add it to an event block, like when we press the green flag. Now the green flag is right up here, and what's going to happen is every time you click this, it's going to reset this sprite, the J, appearance. So for clicking, 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 and it's doing that whole thing, then when we press the green flag, but up, it fixes it. Now what I want you to do is I want you to experiment with adding in uh, when the sprite is clicked and different looks effects, and you can actually combine it with other stuff. So you can add in a whole bunch of blocks right here and be like, I want to change the color and change fisheye at the same time. And then remember, if you want to reset your sprites, when the green flag is clicked, clear the graphic effects and it'll fix the effects for that particular sprite. Hey everyone, if you're watching this on YouTube, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. If you're not watching us on YouTube, you can find us on that platform as well as other social media outlets by searching for Boot Up PD. And if you're looking for more free lessons, projects, and resources for teachers and students, visit us at bootuppd.org, where you can also learn about our high-quality professional development.